Now the pie is opened and the words begin to ring, isn't this a place to fish and catch, well, anything? Yes, it looks like an old fishing village, doesn't it? But although you can catch fish, it's nothing of the sort. It's about five miles from London's Hyde Park corner and goes by the tuneful name of Strand on the Green, a little cluster of Georgian and Queen Anne houses on the river bank by Kew Bridge. In the 16th century, it was called Ye Strand, like Ye Strand or Ye Fleet Street, and it was actually a flourishing fishing village. Salmon teemed in the Thames, and London got most of it from Strand on the Green. Where else in London, or for that matter any other big city, can you sail or fish before breakfast, or from your bedroom window watch the life of the river unfold itself in such pleasant surroundings? In the 17th century, Oliver Cromwell held a council of war in this inn, and the approach to it is still known as Cromwell Steps. Another tavern was a great haunt of smugglers, and Elizabeth's press gangs found many a crew in the tap rooms. Over this bridge, thousands of Londoners and visitors are carried every year to the famous Kew Gardens. The villagers may have to put up with floods and river mists, but in the absence of them, their hearts grow even fonder.